Hello guys and uh, welcome to my channel. I'm a practicing telekinetic for three years. Might as well just call it three years. It's coming right up. Um, I told you that I would capture this light. So the other times that I, I started coming by this light, it was it's like it was frozen. It was stuck on the on position. It wasn't doing this blinking thing. <clears throat> Still getting a handle of electrokinesis. But I gotta let you know, I'm willing to practice for five years every single day to get good at it. Yeah, it is blinking like crazy. And it wasn't doing this the other night. Um, it's my energy, I'm pretty sure. We're gonna go over to the, uh, we'll go over to that floodlight over there and check that out as well. And across the street, where it's the dentist place, that was totally off tonight, and then started blinking. Um, but we're gonna go over to the floodlight and see what happens. I just gotta grab up all this stuff. I went to curry and kebab, and I got myself mushroom mutter with onion bahi and like the pita bread oops it's called naan n-a-n wish I had more heads uh, I don't have my holder with me right now So that's, I learned to carry three items in one hand when I was a server at TGI Fridays. Comes in handy. <laughs> handy. Um, so we'll head over to this floodlight and see if we can affect it. <clears throat> Last night I filmed the floodlight at the Glen Lake Apartments that shines on that sign. Turn it on, turn it off, turn it on, turn it off. I've actually turned this on and turned it off and caused it to flicker and all that kind of stuff. So, uh, let's see. Hold on a sec. I promised to myself in six minutes, I mean if at the six minute mark nothing happens, I'll film another video.
that was it. That was it right there. Look at that. Oh my God. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Sorry about the swearing, but uh, I did it. And I didn't just do it with the floodlight. <laughs> I got that light too, and I've never done that before. Um, other times I've had this, and I didn't know if it happened on purpose or not. Damn, man, and it was right before the six, six minutes. But <clears throat> I've had this gate come down. Um, and I was like, why the heck did the gate come down? I've also had this thing talk to me. Um, so you can walk in front of it, and it may or may not say anything. But then my biomagnetism or whatever, it just suddenly caused it to do that. Okay, so what was I doing? What I was doing was... Uh, I was feeling very at peace. And then I was... Uh, I was remembering when I was, when I was at the Korean kebab, and what happened? Uh, I was remembering what I was doing over there, and then my attention came back here, and I, it's like I, I very slowly, it's like I was getting tighter and tighter and tighter and tighter and tighter and tighter and. Tighter and tighter and tighter and tighter and then it just like it shut off um, and you saw that thing just blink several times this thing's completely off like if it was the gas station <clears throat> this would have just gone off and stayed off if somebody in the gas station had uh, turned it off um, or both of these would be off at the same time look at that look at that look at that yeah, dude. Oh, I remember what I was doing. I've, I've been practicing like this. <sighs> this thing where I imagine electricity running through my body. <sighs> dude. Dude, that is crazy. So it's like it was struggling to come on and then I, I started to bring my hand in towards my body and I started talking about this process that I've been doing, which is I imagine like a zigzag line at each of the chakra points. So I breathe into my Dantian's first and I try to align them, meaning I imagine this um, kind of like a gourd of energy that my my energy is a gourd so the upper dantian is kind of the the smallest gourd and then it gets a little bit bigger where the heart and throat are and then it gets even much bigger around where the stomach is and I imagined electricity, and I actually started feeling a little bit, just a tiny bit of electricity, and then I tightened that, and, and then I tightened that down. Um, and I had a very strong, strong focus forward. With just a pure, pure signal. I mean, it was, it was crazy how tight and how how pure it was. Uh, wow, that was amazing. Let's see if... Uh, I mean, when it happens like this, you know something weird has been going on. I can't say exactly what it is, but... Uh, It's funny, I, I told you guys that I'd be willing to practice for five years every single day to get electricity, to get the, to get really good with it. So, yeah, 
<clears throat> this is a huge win. This is a huge win. I'm super excited. I'm gonna hold on to this. What Mad Cat Sphere says, hold on to your successes, remember them and use them for your future telekinesis. And just, he says, bring them along with you. So you guys saw it. I'm gonna turn this off, but uh, like, subscribe and share. Um, ring that bell notification, comment down below. And uh, until next time, my friends, Peace and be well.